I hate baseball, but I love Ken Griffey Jr. baseball. It's the perfect baseball game. It essentially takes all the crap that made real baseball boring and kept all the good stuff, but put it on the juice. Even more so than the players already were, of course. Here's a great example. Real baseball is slow and can take 30 seconds between pitches. Griffey baseball is fast and takes about three. Real baseball has overgrown players with tiny heads. Griffey baseball has overgrown players with tiny heads. Everybody wins! It had the full assortment of teams and stadiums. However, it did not have the player's license. They had to put up with generic names like B-Kid, with the only real player obviously being Ken Griffey Jr. And what happens when you use Griffey? You're gonna hit a home run every damn time. Not every damn time. His stats are so much better than everyone else in the game, it's just ridiculous. Sure, the ratings go up to 10, but Griffey might as well be 16 in all these categories. He's so overpowering, it's crazy. Back in the day when I played this game for hours upon hours upon hours with my good old buddy Mike Savinsky, we had a no Griffey rule. Even if you don't get to play as him, the game is still ridiculously easy to play. You won't see a split-fingered fastball, but you will find Stuttering Craig's Mega Pitch. Oh, uh, got him! Nothing beats baseball games where you can just move the ball all around everywhere. Oh, and don't get caught stealing. Sucker! It's like games today try to overthink their audience. They try to get every single detail while trying to cater to the hardcore, but when they do so, they make a game way too complicated and end up alienating a totally different audience. Like me! But King Griffey Jr., you'll never do me wrong.